Welcome back, Agent Miko. The Admiral needs us to extract an Imperial ally on my home world of Vardos. The target is Protectorate Gleb, a local official who once mentored both Agent Hask and myself. I don't know how this connects to Operation Cinder, but I have to trust the Admiral. Make the jump to Vardos. That's the Dauntless. It's the ship we rescued on Fondor. Why is it here? Well, it's delivering cargo. It's carrying those satellites. Moff Wraith said they were needed for Operation Cinder. But he wouldn't tell us the target. Neither would the Admiral. Now I know why. Satellites are aligned, sir. Excellent. I did not call for you, Commander Versia. Vardos is our target? One of them, yes. Why? The entire planet and its people, they're, they're loyal to the Empire. The Emperor commands it. We'll purge this planet and others. Fear shall spread and the galaxy will remember who is in control. This is our home. The Empire is our home. And we will do as the Emperor commands. I don't take orders from dead men. You take orders from me! Activate the satellites now. <laughs> Leave for Vardos immediately. Recover Protectorate Pleb. She is your only target. That is all. That is all. We'll find Protectorate Gleb in the Archive. Follow me. Do you still remember your way, Commander? I don't forget so easily, Agent. This storm is unnatural. I've never seen anything like it. The locals must be terrified. This is just the beginning. When people see what we've done here, that terror will spread throughout the galaxy. I'm just surprised we aren't evacuating civilians. Civilians are expendable. Our people will evacuate. These are our people. This is an Imperial world. A place we're supposed to protect. Die here. 
We've put our troopers in harm's way as well. They'll evacuate when ordered to. Their fearlessness in the face of this storm shows true discipline. But Gleb deserves an early evacuation, does she? Gleb oversees the future Imperial Leader School here. She crafts loyal, capable troopers. Like I know. Like me. <sighs> now she's calling it a favor. The people of Vardos are loyal to the Empire. Why should they be left to suffer? This is all for the greater good, Commander. None of this looks good to me. Vardos was our home, Mask. The Empire is our home. Operation Cinder is a test to prove that we are worthy of what it will become. Go ahead. You sound like my father. It is about time. I did Versio. Admiral sent you. I knew I was important to risk his own daughter's life. Target acquired. Get a move on, Gleb. Well, she is giving me orders now, precious. Whoa, 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 get... Look, he is with me. The others will stay here. They are not important. Come. Commander. We have a ship on landing bay two. You'll be safe there. Go. Go now. Go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are you doing? No, no, no. Stop. Ah! stop. This is not our mission. Stand down. It's okay. We'll get you off world. Go. No. 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 Don't you. I am your commander. Stand down. Aiden, our orders are clear. We are to recover the Protectorate Gleb alone. Things have changed. Look around you, man. Do you even recognize the Empire Del, anymore? please don't do this. The Just Empire's do this. job is to save civilians from things like Operation Cinder. This is the new Empire. If this is the new Empire, I want no part of it. I'm taking the orders of my commanding officer. Are these your orders? Are these your orders? Because if they are, this is treason. Yes. Then I have mine. Lower your weapon. Defines where we're the death of you. I'm Versio. Commander Versio. And they took me to have abandoned the mission they've committed treason. Understood. Return Gleb to me. That is your mission. I will take care of the traitors. Hello everyone, and welcome back to our Let's Play of Star Wars Battlefront 2. Today we're playing on The Storm. And as you guys can see... We need to uh, kind of navigate our way through without being detected, which could be a little bit difficult because it looks like we have a guy right up there. We need to get out of the open. See if we can inch our way up here real quick. We're going to have to kind of get behind the stormtrooper so that we can do an assassination on him real fast. All right, so he's been taken care of. We got one more in front of us. We'll try to be as stealthy as possible for as long as we can. Obviously, there are just so many stormtroopers around that I'm afraid that they might end up finding us. We have to reach the corpse and get out of Imperial space. It's our only chance. Father, they'll shoot it down before we can leave. Then we need to take down the anti-air cannons. This is very bad. Keep it together, Agent Miko. We have civilians on the corpse relying on us. We don't have Imperial comms anymore. Corvus won't even know we're coming. We'll figure it out. Alright, so we got this one stormtrooper. We'll do another takedown here real fast. He was kind of chasing after the civilians, so I don't feel too bad about taking him out of commission. I'm gonna slowly creep our way up here, but I can hear lots of people around. Looks like maybe one or two people up here as well. I can hear some comms. Actually, it looks like we have a couple more than anticipated. 
We might wait and see if they happen to walk past us. The only problem is, is we do have that stormtrooper that we took down kind of laying in the middle of the hallway. So I'm a little worried about being detected that way, though. We'll kind of let him walk by, and I'm guessing, yep, there's his friend right behind him. Should be able to inch my way back out. We got one more that's kind of picking up the slack at the moment. The moment that dude is really investigating that wall, if you guys couldn't tell. He was not really sure whether or not it was as smooth as it looked. Luckily, Dell was actually on our side. I'm sure you guys saw from the cutscene that he seems to be kind of agreeing with us. It does look like the stormtroopers are now attacking the city. Obviously, there's just a lot of war crimes that are going on at the moment. You know, we're not really defending the civilians. We're kind of turning back on them, which is not really anything that the Empire's not known for doing. But at the same time, it's kind of a little confusing considering that you would think that you'd want to be in the good graces of people that kind of agree with your ideology for the most part, but... That is not the case, but it's probably more out of fear, though. I mean, at the same time, you have all these starships kind of above you. You're going to kind of agree with just about anything that they say, even if they're in the wrong. Escaping ships. We're not the only ones searching for safety. Slice, please. This way. Stay quiet and they won't see us coming. Understood. Wait for my mark. We can always call our little robot to do some shocking if we need to as well. So that may be something that we look into, but I'm kind of curious to see where that other, oops, that other stormtrooper disappeared off to. Might have our robot go after that guy. See this light. Oh, unfortunately, that did not quite work. All right, we just got this one guy up here. I'm hoping that the noise wasn't too much so that they weren't really drawn to it. I think we'll probably be okay. I don't see reinforcements just yet. We may still be able to continue on with our stealth mission. We are getting detected at the moment. I may try to see if we can actually run to the other side because I did see that there was a way to get down here, though. We can be as stealthy as possible. This will work out in our favor. I'm just afraid that there's just so many infantry all over the place that this could be a little tricky. Whoa, how am I getting detected? All right, well, unfortunately, it's time to go loud. We're just going to have to kind of take care of as many as we can. Worked out pretty well for us for quite a while, but obviously all the good things must come to an end, and it's time to use our blaster. Alright, let's release some of that heat real fast, and then we'll re-engage. We just got this one more guy here. Got one more up there. He's kind of stuck on an animation at the moment. All right, let's pop our reconnaissance so we can locate where all these people are. We probably should have done that even earlier, but it's always better to do it now than never. Luckily, these stormtroopers don't have good aim, so we don't have to worry so much about them kind of being much of a threat to us. Walker. 
Exactly. And if we destroy the targeting dishes, we'll disable every AA in the sector. This one's almost taken care of. Uh, there we go. You would think that those first two blasters shouldn't have been more than enough, though. I felt like this uh, weapon is just so destructive that I don't think it should have taken that many hits, though. All right, so we need to destroy this. It's almost taken care of. I think we actually stepped on somebody. We're actually taking a little bit of live fire down there. We're going to destroy that chicken walker real quick. Almost taken care of. There we go. Still got some more turrets that obviously we need to get rid of these AA turrets. They're shooting at people trying to escape. Trying to flee. All right, we got another walker a little bit down there. Obviously, we got quite a bit of people all over. I feel like I already shot this thing. There we go. Must not have uh, put another volley into it. It kind of needed a little bit more firepower, it looks like. All right, so this looks like this might take several hits, actually. Maybe about two more volleys and it should be taken care of and we should be on our last one. Did it! Weapons in this sector are disabled. Get to the Corvus. We are leaving Bardos. I'm bringing us as close as I can. High fighter down. It's been taken care of. Look at all these infantry. Trying to run away, they stand no chance. Put some damage on him. Got some more ATSTs actually right in front of us. I'm gonna try to destroy this first though. All right, we got another ATAT -AT right over to our side. We're getting shot by a TIE fighter as well. I might destroy him real quick. Trying to put as much fire as I can on the front of this, but it has just so much armor. There we go. As you guys can see, we got about two more infantry over to our side down there, but tons of infantry kind of actually down here. These guys are about to run right in front of us. There we go. Got one more down. These other two are almost in range. Corvus, we are nearly there. Hurry, Commander! The storm is... Well, we'll buy some time here. We're actually going to go clear out these infantry. Let's pop our main scan so we can detect where these guys are. As you guys can see, a couple more guys down there, but nothing too crazy yet. We're going to move up to our boxes, trying to use this good cover since it's solid and should give us a chance to kind of move around.
All right, I'm actually going to head up here real quick. Looks like we got some additional pieces of equipment, but I don't quite need these launchers yet. I'm going to pop our scan real quick so we can locate where everybody's kind of moving to. A little bit of inaccuracy at that medium range. It looks like uh, Blaster's not perfect for that, though. That guy's about taken care of. We got actually one right below us, which we'll go maybe beat him up real fast. Looks like he might have died. Ooh, look at all these guys. We got lots of people down here. Looks like we got an AT, AT actually pushing in on us. You guys can see lots more guys down there. We'll get a grenade maybe on that guy in that corner, maybe. It looks like it just was a little out of range. It didn't quite make it. Got so many infantry over here. I don't really see anything to necessarily fight the ATAT -AT with. Got some blasters, but other than that, I'm not seeing anything... Try to use some of these, but I don't know how effective these are going to be. Got a scout walker all the way over there. Worry about him in just a minute. I got quite a bit of infantry around. Agent Husk reporting. Mission accomplished, sir. Congratulations, Commander. So, we're not completely alone. Some of the crew stayed with us, protected the refugees against those who wouldn't. How are they? Shaken, confused, but safe. Just want to know what's next. We have to warn people. Who? The rebels? They're just gonna toss us in Sunspot prison before we can even say a word. That's why I think you should just take the Corvus and go. Leave me a TIE fighter. I'll set off a distress call, wait for the rebels to find me. <laughs> you really think I'm gonna let you just float out here alone? Del. We're Infernal Squad. You and me. 